Hello everyone! Hello! Hi! Welcome along to another Animal Crossing livestream. Sorry for the slightly late start. Uh, yeah. You use some software every day for a whole bunch, and then one day it renders all the video in a 4-3 aspect ratio at quarter resolution, and you just don't know why. It's all the fun of the fair. Hello everyone in the chat, thanks for checking in. Clumsy by fact says, hi Luke. <laughs> a lot of people saying egg. Because they can tell already that it is the egg festival. What's it called? Egg? Egg? Egg time? Happy... Happy egg time for Easter, but not Easter. <laughs> I'm not sure. Anyway. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um... Let's dive straight into Animal Crossing, shall we? Bunny Day! Bunny Day, that's what we're calling it. It's Bunny Day, of course, sorry. My bad. Okay. So, welcome everyone. Hi, the Fran Ban. Hi, Bionic Benoit. Hi, Rebecca M. Oh, look! We start the day with Isabel. I haven't opened the game yet today, so you are getting a fresh, fresh new update. Hello there, everyone. Right now, or not at all, it's 1.12pm on Thursday. Don't remind me of the late start, Isabel. I don't need you giving me a hard time. Now for today's announcements. We have a new friend on our island. Let's give it up for Gladys. That's right. Gladys, who I found wandering around on a deserted island and brought into the fold. It makes me so happy to have a new friend on the island. Also, the most wonderful thing happened. Yes, the Able Sisters tailoring shop has opened! We are gonna go and see the Able Sisters. Awesome. That's great news. What a great beginning. The tailor shop will have all the fashion items you'd expect, as well as a custom design gallery. This is a great chance for everyone to enjoy new styles and maybe start our own not at all trends. And of course, we'll be holding a special ceremony to celebrate the happy news. We gotta remember to do that ceremony. If you're interested in participating and have the time, please check in with Tom Nook at Resident Services. That's all for now. Hope you enjoy the loveliest of lovely days. Just before we press out of this, um, she says check in with Tom Nook. As far as I can tell by looking at the room, this little scene is happening from Tom Nook's point of view. This looks like we are getting Tom Nook's eyeline. Am I right? Okay, fair enough. Ah, oh, great. And we're away. It's a brand new day on Not At All. I can't wait to show you folks what's new since last time we played on Monday. First, obviously got to check the mail, see what we got. Oh! We got a, we got something from Ellen. Saw this and thought of you. Aww. See what that gift is. A letter from Nook Inc, a new resident, moved to a plot you set up. We've put a thousand Nook miles into your account. That was great. Cheers. Cheers, Tom. Ah! My lucky KK record has arrived. Excellent. Uh, and so has my garden faucet. Uh, and what's this from the Nook Mileage program? Great. Let's place that in the pocket. Okay. Now, I can't remember what all these things are. So let's check out... First, let's check out uh, the gift from Ellen. Folks... It's fossilized poop. You work with someone for years. You think you know them. And then something like this happens. And then they send you fossilized poop on a live stream. Well... Well, <laughs> KV Pisa says, like Spike for the Coprolite. I think that would be a good idea. But the joke's on you, Ellen, because I actually love dinosaur poop. So I'm delighted with that Coprolite. Thank you very much. I will be taking it to the museum. <laughs> Saul Reed says, thank you for the stream, Luke. I've lost count of the days in a row. I've worked the bakery and it's my birthday today. So the relaxed stream is welcome. Happy birthday, Saul Reed. 
friend of the channel. Saul, happy birthday. Hope you'll have, have a wonderful one. Um, right. Let's move on from this unfortunate dung incident. See what else we got. Ah, oh, yes, the sandbox I ordered. Okay, and what's what else is this? Ah, the garden force. Okay, we're going to put these things out because, folks, our main mission in the game at the moment is we've got to make the nut place nice so that KK Slider shows up. KK Slider is a very discerning and very skilled musician, and KK Slider is not going to show up to a trash island like mine. So we've got to make it nice so that KK appreciates it. Um, and I think we begin that by putting my latest KK record, Lucky KK, up on the wall. Let's straighten that up. That's not that's not quite right. Luke T. Simmons says, I nabbed a stringfish at 11.55 on the 31st. I rewatched your reactions to the two stringfish and the sturgeon. So entertaining. More today, please. And also, egg. Ah, uh, folks, do you remember when I caught that stringfish? Remember that? Remember those precious memories? Ah, uh, look, here's one of my stringfish now, chilling out. Chilling out. Okay. Impure Thought says, today is my birthday, so I had an Animal Crossing birthday party. Please say hi to my lovely boyfriend, Jason, who works hard to make life fun for me. Uh, happy birthday. Happy birthday and hi to Jason. Well done for making life nice. Ah, okay. I want you guys to meet a new island resident. I'm going to be completely honest. I'm not sure about this fellow. His name is Beardo. He's extremely arrogant and I think weirdly tall, but... I'm accepting all residents at the moment. All residents, because uh, I need more residents to get the place nice for KK. Beardo says, hey, what's the good word? Let's chat. Another day in paradise, or as I like to call it, not at all. Okay, Beardo, you're saying the right things. Okay, that's all you have to say. You got something for me? I just want to chat, Beardo. Well, look at you, all fresh and fancy for spring in your career jacket. Okay, alright, Beardo is now saying nice things, so maybe I was wrong about you, Beardo. <laughs> Whitney S says, Beardo doesn't even have a beard. <laughs> Broxiston says, this is what I've missed about being able to watch live fossil poop. Uh, watching live adds so much to the experience instead of watching the next day. Yeah, you get the live reaction. You know that as you're watching right now, somewhere in the world, Luke is receiving that poop live. Uh, okay, so I've put a few flowers out because, again, we're trying to make the nice place nice for KK. Uh, my money tree has sprouted cash, so let's pick that up. Great stuff. Um, let's show you what else I got. So I'm working on a little kids' play area here. Um, I've got to fence it off, though, because at the minute it looks a bit sort of incongruous. Um, children will love to play with this large, frightening Godzilla. But see, see what it does. Look, when I, when I press it, when I press his tickle his tummy, tickle his tummy and hear him roar... And see him breathe fire. Kids love that. Kids will love it. Let's check in with Cole. Now Cole is a primo island resident. How you doing? What's the latest, Cole? I'm gonna go real hard today. Gonna play hard, snack hard, yell cool hard. Cole, I love your energy. I love your attitude. Um, right, I've got to put down my sand pit in in this sort of play area that I'm trying to trying to create. Oh, it's a sandbox. Hey! Nice. Nice. Let's, I think let's flip it around, though. Yeah, good. Good, that's cute, right? Also, I need to show you folks something that absolutely blew my mind. I don't know if any of you have spotted this. You might not have. But look, if you go up to the T-Rex, you might not think there's anything you can do. But look. It's alive! Woo! The mouth opens. Andy in the chat says there are no children on the island, Luke. Yeah, but you know, like the the, the kids' play area doesn't just have to be for kids. Like we like adults can have fun with in the sand pit as well. Um, lots of dragonflies around now. Um. Oh, that's a nice looking one. I think I've got it already, but let's nab it. Ah, the Raja Brooks Birdwing. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Uh, so, my um, my water gardens are coming along quite nicely. Check it out, I've got some bamboo now. And bamboo shoots growing. So this little island bit in the middle is looking pretty lovely, I think, now. And what's this? 
Eggs on the trees. So, as we approach um, Eggopolis, as I think it's called. What's it called? Egg Bunny Bunny Day. As we approach Bunny Day, uh, an Earth egg. Uh, there are eggs to be found all over the shop. Uh, in the sky, in the rivers, they are everywhere. And it is our duty to find them so that we can craft special recipes. You can see I've got a whole bunch on my person already. Uh, and I do have some recipes so we can do some crafting. Um, ba -doop -ba -doop -bump. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Uh, Profiler Cal, new member. Hi, welcome. And Josie Hicks says, hi, Luke. These streams are a welcome distraction from the PhD application process. Love to all of you and hope you stay safe and well. As uh, Ron Reardon says, Luke calls his island trash. Also, Luke literally has a fountain surrounded by, ba by bamboo and cherry blossoms. I know it's lovely, but the fact is that KK Slider would still consider my island to be trash garbage. And I trust KK Slider's opinion above all things. Um, why don't we go check out the Able Sister shop? And catch this fish on the way. Harry GT GTT says, uh, "Hi Luke, a sandbox in a sandbox game is early in the morning in Argentina. In Argentina, and this is funny for me. It's funny for me too." And Ellie J says, "Just wanted to say thank you for streaming at an Aussie-friendly time. Not all of us have the fortitude to watch at the usual 4 a.m. Yeah, I know our normal streaming schedule is a little brutal um, for those in Australia, but we tr this is this is this is why we try and mix it up." Right, I'm really screwing up this fish catching. Next time we go by the museum, by the way, folks, i got to show you what I got in there because I've nabbed a few more quite exciting fish. And this is not one of them. It's an old tire. <laughs> That's no good. Okay, look at this. Okay, question one. How do I get this, like, nightmare clown suit in the window? Oh my gosh, this place is so nice. Welcome to Able Sisters, where we sell fashions made lovingly by Claw. <laughs> okay. Oh hey, it's the great spot finder, Luke. I assume that's sarcastic, because there's actually no bridge or access to where I've put the shop. So, Mabel, the, the Able Sisters are currently stuck. Um, thanks for picking this fantastic location for us. We've decided to put down roots here on Not At All and keep selling our clothes and accessories. Let me give you a quick tour of the shop. Yes, please, Mabel. So when you first walk in, you'll find our recommended items right there front and centre. We change these up every single day to keep things fresh. Then over on the left, you'll find our mannequins. They're terrifying. They're dressed up in whatever seasonal outfits we're into. We change them up from time to time rather than daily, just to maintain the illusion that they're alive and haunted. Still, we hope you'll be inspired. And of course, if you see something on the mannequins you love, you're more than welcome to buy it. Which brings us to the back wall. Here you'll find custom designs brought in by our customers. We'd love to display your designs, of course. And if you want any of these designs, they're yours for free. Ah, oh, Mabel, I bet you'd like my designs. I bet you would. Custom designs portal. You can use that kiosk to order designs for creators all over the world and even share your own. Amazing. Okay, Mabel. Alright, I get it. I get it, I get it. 9am to 9pm. Wow, those are brutal opening hours. Uh, right, let's see. Oh my gosh. The long search is over, folks. Look at this ensemble. And wow. What a... What a... <laughs> I like the way Mabel follows you around. Graduation gown. This mask. I quite like these hiking boots. Oh, and these designs are nice. Let's, uh, a stellar jumpsuit. I mean, look how garish it is. Uh, Yul Mez M AMS says, Hi Luke, um, watching these streams inspired me to finally get the game. Greeting from Imbeciles. Oh, <laughs> Imb Imbis, Imbis, Imbis Isles, Imbeciles. I like it, that's good. Um... Right, I probably should buy this, right? Yep. Yeah. Alright, let's try it out. See how we look. Yep, yeah, as expected, it's, um... It's incredible. It's just a great look. 
let's 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 try out the fitting room. Let's 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 check out check out some of these looks. Oh my gosh, look, so many so many options. <gasps> Little chef's outfit. Ooh, a multi-purpose vest. It's like a sort of photographer's jacket. Oh, n look at the bounce on this on the dress. Look at the way it sort of moves. That's rendered nicely. Oh, hold the phone. We've got ourselves a real strong look here, folks. Maybe I should have bought this stellar jump or this stellar jumpsuit. Gothic headdresses, rave shades, patterned socks. Now let's talk about the boot selection. Wow, this place is this place is a dream. They've got incredible stock. Uh, Joshua Commelson says, "I hope you have a fantastic day and thank you for your awesomeness." Thank you. Oh my word! Look at these. Look at these great. These items are astounding. Ooh, not sure about the fedora. Hang on. Adventure dress, school pants, colourful skirt, old school jacket, baseball shirt. This is great. What a great, what a great selection. Well, I love this small silk hat. That's my favourite thing that I've seen so far. I think. Um. Let's try and let's try and put, pair, make an outfit make an outfit around it, shall we? Uh, let's lose these glasses because I'm not sure about them. I look like I'm in like Hogwarts masquerade. Um, I'm not sure about the gown, you know. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay, I think this is probably going to be like 90% of the stream, just as like a heads up. Oh my god, with the little socks and the, oh, the boots. Now that's a look. Um, the shoes. Denim painter's pants. School pants. Oh, here we go. The white, the white jeans. Now we're talking. It's real hard. To, it's real hard to choose. Okay, well let's go for. This feels like a sort of. This feels like a. This feels like a tidy ensemble. Uh, not the shoes though. The shoes aren't working, and I need to lose that backpack. Um. I think no socks with this. Hmm, the black boots or the red boots? Best Bloomer says the dress, boots, and mini hat is such a look. It all looks so adorable. You know what? I might do is just hang on cancel out I just thought this would be quicker and then go back in I think I might just buy the little hat Jane gave you that backpack reminds reminds me of the chat I know Jane gave me the backpack but Jane would be the first to admit that if color wise something's not working with your outfit you got to whack it in storage it can't it can't stay indefinitely, you know. The whole point is we want to make we want to mix it up as much as possible. Come on, Luke, put some trousers on. Look, I know we're all working from home, but some effort must be made. Oh, the dress is so cute. Ah, <laughs> uh, screw it. I'm buying the dress. Yeah, I want to wear what I picked out. Yes! Oh, that backpack has got to go. Um, I'm buying this whole outfit and, uh, like, Jane is going to lose her mind for this dress, I think. It's got such Prudence vibes. 
Um... <laughs> Andy says, Abel Sisters is open for one day. <laughs> All right. Um... Yep. I mean, how could I have any regrets? But yeah, but yeah, let's lose the let's lose the rucksack. Jane would understand. She'll definitely understand when I gift her this dress, having you know had my having had my time in it, run around in it. I change outfits so often in this game. And wouldn't you, if the selection was this strong? Uh, I don't know what butter. I think I've got that butterfly already, but can't hurt to have a spare. Edward Svard says, is it just me or does Mabel look like Sonic from behind? There's a theory there. And Lixie Lou says, red boots are a must, Luke. Yeah, complete, completely agree. Um, oh, that earned me some Nook Miles. Right, uh, I think the next thing to do is uh, check in with Isabel and see what my island is missing because it's obviously missing some stuff because KK Slider doesn't want to visit my trash island, so we've got to get things nice for KK. Uh, Alright, let's bag that net, get a few more of these earth eggs, see what we can craft uh, in, a, in a moment out of these. Right. Kume says, catch the Sakura petals. I didn't know you could catch the... You can catch the petals? Uh, Franbozilla C says, I bought every colour of towel dress. Very wise. Very wise. It's an investment. An investment piece. Uh, right, first things first in here. Um, gotta buy my... Uh, gotta buy my KK record for the day. Dun, 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 dun. KK Gumbo. Yes, please. Oh, look at these trash clothing items. So glad the Able Sisters are here. MJ says, who do you think is inside the zipper tea bunny suit? <laughs> uh, I don't. I honestly don't know. I'm a little creeped out by the Easter Bunny. We'll go find him in a minute, see if he's around. Oh, check out this imperial fence. So I really need more fencing on the island, but I don't want to... I don't want to build a fence that I'm not happy with. And so far, the recipes that are showing up day by day, I'm not so inspired by. The imperial one, though, that's kind of nice, but it's a little... Um, it's 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 nice, but it's a little severe. Um, nevertheless, I'm going to buy it, because when I do... Uh, when I when I will want to build it, I'll be glad of the recipe. So, Kalasanti Santi says, "Now, Luke, take the axe in your hands, and the look is complete." <laughs> uh, Emio Jen says, "You've got to have your best dress on for KK." That is true. Words were never spoken. Right, Imperial Fence. Let's learn it. Okay, um, Isabel, let's talk island assessment. Oh, Luke, good afternoon. How can I help you today? Um, <laughs> Shen of Spade says, I cheered out loud when you bought the dress. Thank you, team, for being such a light during these dark times. No worries. Uh, right, okay. Brace yourselves, folks. This isn't going to be good news, but it's okay. We're going to fix it. You're curious about the current image of Not At All? Yes. Two star rating. Okay, that's actually better than I thought we would do. There's some positive buzz floating around. Folks are starting to take notice. Allow me to read an excerpt from the feedback. It's great that there isn't too much going on. I hope it'll stay nice and unassuming like me. Well, there you have it. Now, if you want feedback from anyone else, increasing the population must be our main focus. Well, but let me know if you have any time after that because the island's scenery needs some work as well. I think you could create some pretty scenery and memorable vistas if you use some fencing here and there. Okay, so this is, what this is what I'm saying. We need more fence. We need more fence. Patrick Barkley says, put the barbed wire fence around the playground. Safety is number one priority. <laughs> okay, so here's the thing. 
Isabel wants more residents. But the thing you should know is that yesterday I recruited another resident to move to my island. So, in fact, there is one more uh, inbound. <laughs> Andy in the chat says, you want to keep those children in. <laughs> maybe we should. Maybe we should barbed wire fence the... Uh, maybe we should barbed wire fence the, um, the kids' enclosure. Or... Um, Maybe we could put up some of that imperial fencing in my in my water garden. Might be nice. Lines 87 says working from home, a million things to do, but I need to know what fence Luke buys. Uh, <laughs> so let's just have a little check on the island because I can't remember if I put down a new plot for the new resident. So yes, I did. So you can see um you can see just to the right of the shop that empty yellow square that's where our newest resident will be moving in um why don't we go to, why don't we try and find gladys the newest newest resident see, see how she's doing along the way we can sort of brainstorm some scenery ideas maybe uh okay oh hello look that is a pretty rare mantis one of the one of the pink ones that's quite hard to see Try and sneak up on it. Oh, easy. Play it cool. Play it cool. Be chill, Mantis. Don't even worry about it. Don't even. Don't even. Don't even. Yeah. Nice. An orchid, Mantis. Uh, Lita the Cuttlefish says, Hey Luke, about to join an impromptu medical student workforce to help out hospitals. So this will be my last stream for a while. So I just want to say you guys are amazing, constantly inspirational. Well, uh, thank you very much. That's so kind of you to say. It sounds like you're the one who's um, doing the doing the good work out there. So uh, yeah, thank thank you for doing that. And thank you for tuning in as well. And Coltono DK says, uh, Like the developers Animal Crossing approved that Isabella and the Doomslayer are best friends. Have they approved that? I didn't see. But I mean, but good. That's good because, frankly, I need I need Nintendo officially to pay a little more attention to uh, to Doom, if you know what I mean. Uh, right, we were headed over here, right? We were gonna we were gonna meet Gladys. Oh my God, there's so much getting sidetracked in this game, but it's so good. An Earth egg. Oh yeah, let, I tell you what. Let me show you the um. Let me show you some of the earth recipes that I've got. Um, so, we've got the bunny day rug. That's craftable. That's craftable. Can I filter these by bunny stuff? <laughs> Seasonal recipes. Okay. So, yeah, we've got the bunny day rug. We've got the bunny day bed. We've got the bunny day glowy garland. We've got the bunny day wall. we got the stone egg shell. And then we got the leaf egg shoes and outfits the stone egg outfit i don't know if i have to craft just like the furniture or if i have to craft like all of the outfits as well um if anyone in the chat can let me know i'd appreciate it because um yeah i would be i would be interested um okay right let's go check out let's go check in on gladys Knock, knock. Regal Rowan says, Hey Luke, I've been sad because my country's FA, FFA lamb show is cancelled because of the quarantine the Animal Crossing live streams help. Ah, oh, well thank you very much for watching and welcome along new member that guy with a beard as well. Um, ah, here we go. Here is here's Gladys. Luke, I'm so glad we met on that island and that I'm all moved in here now. I've still got lots of unpackings to do but I'm really looking forward to spending time together here. Ah, oh, Gladys, I don't know what kind of Bird you are, but it's cool. So should I put the rug there, and then on top, or should the rug go there, and then on top instead? Might be overthinking this. Oh, Gladys. All right, I'm going to leave you to it, Gladys. Ali Lee says, I think you have to craft everything. Everything. Okay, well, we can do that. We can do that. Niall Clark says, just want to shout out so I can show off. My girlfriend is obsessed with Animal Crossing. Much love, Luke. Hey, Niall. Here's a shout out. And hi to the girlfriend as well. Obsessed with Animal Crossing, what excellent taste. And hello, FL Slider, new member. Now, this better be a fossil. Come on, give me a fossil. 
No earth eggs. I don't want earth eggs. I want feathers. Uh, is anyone in the campsite today? No, doesn't look like it. All right, it's fine. That is fine. As I say, we've got residents. We've got a new resident about to move in. So I'm hoping that'll tip us into uh, into an acceptable populace for KK. So can you grab these petals? I'm just grabbing weeds. Uh, right, I really should uh, hit these rocks. Ben Sadler says, maybe Doomguy and Isabel met on Kohalint Island in Animal Village. Yep, makes sense to me. All checks out. Uh, and he says, KK's going to have something to say about these weeds. Oops. Yeah, there's a lot of weeds on this bit of the island. But here's the thing. I like this part of the island. Oh, you use a net to catch the petals. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, <gasps> a gold nugget. I just got a gold nugget out of this rock. Don't even care that the shovel broke because those gold nuggets are crazy rare. Yes. Yes. Got to get those sweet golden nugs. I've got one. This is my second. That's cool. Um, all right. Uh, yeah, I am going to have to do some weeding up here, aren't I? Might, mm, might postpone that a little bit. Don't want to necessarily fill this stream with weeding. I say necessarily. I might still do it. Um, uh, now that is me out of shovel. So let's go get a shovel. Oh look, here's a petal. Yay! This cherry blossom pe petal is so lovely. Pink is really its color. Ah, oh, thanks the chat for telling me how um, how that was achieved. Right, let's head on over to a crafting spot. Who is that? Is that a dinosaur up there, like a lizard? I do not recognise this animal. <gasps> but I love this. I love this animal's rad style. Oh, it's Flick. Do you live here? I'm Flick. I'm kind of a bug buff, an insect enthusiast, an arthropod artist. I love all bugs in their appendages. I've been traveling across all the islands looking for my soul bug, the perfect inspiration for my art. I must capture every wiggling leg, every joint of the antenna. We're so lucky to live in their world. So if you find a bug, will you sell it to me? I can pay a little extra. No price is too high for my chitinous kindred. And that's any bug. Devotion with conditions isn't devotion at all. Wow, Flick. Wow, so true. Brandon Hart says, KK needs 10 residents total from everything I've seen, plus minimal weeds and lots of flowers. Okay. Um, and Kaipon Visp says, just want you to know that your excitement always makes you smile, even when I'm down in the dumps. Never change. Like, oh, thank you very much. Oh, and if you're um, interested in my art at all, just um, let me know. My commissions are open. Uh, well, I've got a bug to sell, Flick. I'm interested in these increased... Um, okay, I'm only going to sell the ones that I'm caught so confident um, are not in the museum. I'm pretty sure that is... I'm pretty sure all these are, to be honest, but I didn't take the risk. Welcome along, new member uh, Louis Fellows. Whoa, that's good money for bugs. Thanks, Flick. Nice. Let me know if you catch any more. Flick, I think you are, like, the coolest ever. And I want to know about your commissions. Killer Inca says, hello from Czech Republic, watching Loot play Assassin um, Assassin's Creed. Animal Crossing while playing Breath of the Wild for the first time. Just beat my first White Lionel. Thank God for fairies. Wow, congratulations. They are tough. And Lady X Grey Wolf says, wish I could be responsible and self-isolate, but Swedish and a teacher. Thanks for keeping my spirits up. Oh, well, thank you for, thank you for the teaching. That is, that is important. 
that is real important. But yeah, I'm sorry that, that, that self-isolating isn't an option right now. Uh, right, hang on, sorry, Flick, what are you saying? I see to catch a shadow that form on my I do need live models to work from. I don't charge bells. If there's a bug you want me to sculpt, bring me three of them. Sculpt a bug. Amazing. Who wouldn't want bug sculptures? Uh, I mean, Ellen. Oops, just get off a of mantis. Flick won't like that. Um. Whee! Wow. Dragonflies everywhere. Okay, so if I need 10 residents, how many residents do I have at the moment? Okay, I've got, well, eight, including myself, so I'll have nine tomorrow. So on the stream today, we should absolutely um, pop to a mystery island, see if we can find another one. Um, and that would make ten in a couple of days' time. Right, uh, let's order my thoughts a little bit here. Uh, let's let's head to the museum, because uh, I want to hand in that coprolite, and I also want to show you folks a fish I caught. But do 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 Oh, a balloon! Oh, I missed a balloon. Well, it was probably a sky egg. And they are everywhere. Why, hello, Luke. Welcome to the museum. How many be of service? I wish to make a donation, please, Blathers. Okay, so all of those bugs were... Yeah, okay, so the only thing I have to offer is Ellen's dino poop. Alright, better do the Blathers voice if we're handing something in. Alright. <clears throat> oh, 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 could it be? It is a coprolite. I never thought I'd lay eyes upon such a well-preserved coprolite. Dear me, might I give you a short presentation on the topic? I am quite knowledgeable, do you know? Yes, please, Blathers. Wonderful, it is fascinating stuff, I assure you. Now, where to begin? Coprolites are, in fact, um, a bit of um, fossilised uh, 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 faeces. Who you? It's true. It must be said there are also astonishing treasure troves of ancient information. Eh, what? Uh, for example, the coprolite from certain plant-eating dinosaurs has been found to contain small pebbles. This tells us that these dinosaurs, like many modern birds, ate rocks to help grind the greens in their bellies. Indeed, fossilized feces reveal not only what food the dinos ate, but how they digested it too. Who knew? And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Oh, rest assured, all donations are displayed in a timely manner. You have my gratitude. And blathers, you have our gratitude. Oh, Caitlin, AC, AC, RC says it isn't ten residents needed. I've got eight work on fencing and furniture. Okay. Uh, Lionel L says, good morning from the Seattle area. Luke, that new outfit is styling. Thank you. Um, all right. So should we go have a look at Ellen's coprolite? Um, let's do it. It'll be in here, I imagine. Oh, or I would have thought it's in here. But, oh no, maybe not. Unless that's it over there, but I don't think so. Try the buy. Uh, yeah, no. Bum ba ba dum ba ba. Da 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 da. Okay, what's going on in here? Ah, there it is. It's quite obvious now that I see it. There it is, the coprolite. The offending item. Unbelievable. A T-Rex. I can't believe I've got two T-Rex head and torsos, but not uh, a tail. Right. So, I think we need to make the island pretty. So let's do some decorations. Let's uh, go to a mystery island and get some flowers so that we can like get more flowers. Uh, and then, um, uh, uh, yeah, and then maybe some fencing as well. 
Right now, let's take a look at the fish that I've got. There's the sturgeon and the string fish. Remember when I caught that string fish? Um, yeah, we got some. We got some great specimens in here now. We've got some. Look at that little pretty colourful fish in there. And then, uh, stop being nice. Says, love your Mary Poppins cosplay, Luke. Uh, I didn't think of that. Um. There's my anchovies. I love that tank. It is so chill. And then check it out. We bagged the oarfish. Look at that bad boy. The incredible size and scale. And then <laughs> Daniel, uh, David Conover says, need the merch. Remember when I caught that string fish? Oh yeah, that would be sweet merch. And then look, it's looking real nice in here as well. We've got a few interesting ones. Look, I've got a poisonous looking fish down there along the bottom of the screen. Can't remember what it's called. Zebra something, something, something. Um, I just touched it with my bare hands when I caught it, which seems unwise. And now look, there's a little coral reef up here, including look. There's a, a clownfish. Is, clownfish is in there. There's a Nemo fish. Yay! All of which makes me very happy indeed. But how am I going to show my great museum to KK Slider uh, if KK Slider doesn't arrive? Okay. And he says KK would spit on this museum. <laughs> I don't think that's necessarily true. <laughs> Maybe. Um, right. What are we doing? Again, I've lost... I've completely lost my thread. Uh, I need to sort out my inventory. Um, sell some stuff. Craft some stuff. Um, and then we need to crack on with decorating. Whoa! I didn't know that on sale today was this horrible anatomic figure. Check the turnip prices. 126 bells per turnip! That's a solid return! I paid 110 bells per turnip, which seemed very high. Uh, so I am I am cashing in now. This is the highest I've seen it. I'm cashing in on this stream. We're doing it. I'm gonna go pick up my turnips It's time um, I can turn the, I can turn three old tires into something uh, So let's sell this and oh the bugs really oh, see now. This is a problem now now I should really give these bugs to flick while flicks around does that mean I've only got one thing to sell? I've got the garden force it to put out. Ugh, okay, right. What I really need is, is storage rather than... Uh, we'll get there. Miss Kujiku says, What are the eggs for? They are for crafting for... Um... Ooh, people saying turnips can go even higher. But will they? Sarah Sheet says all people on Twitter with a turnip price of 600 bells. Well, you know what? That's fine for people on Twitter, but it's Thursday already. I've only got two day. I've only got like two days for prices to go higher, and I'm not sure they're gonna. I'm cashing out now while it's still, while it's still profit. Um, oh, I build a bridge. Hang on, let me just show you my bridge. There should be a new bridge over here now if construction is complete. Yay! Look at this, isn't this darling? Whee! Isn't that precious? Like everything in this game. Yeah, alright. I'm going in here, putting some stuff in storage, crafting some stuff, getting my turnips. Um, okay. Let's pop... Uh, let's, let's, do, let's do some crafting first. Should I craft something? Yeah, let's craft. Um, okay. 
So that where's that fencing? I did buy it, right? Uh, was that a recipe? That was a was that a recipe? I think that was a recipe. Oh, I was I was, I was just couldn't see it. Oh my goodness, brilliant! Even though it's really fancy, it's just wood and softwood. Okay, that's that is good. All right, I will definitely be making some imperial fencing then because I do have some wood in storage. Uh, what do I need? I need need new sh need new flimsy shovel. Um, all right, that's wood as well. Um, cool, 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 cool. All right, all right, we're good. 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 Um, this stone arch. Um, all right, let's let's just let's just get let's just put some stuff in storage and get some stuff out. Oh yeah, wait, hang on. The tire. Let's make the tire thing. Oh. Andy says it's currently 190 bells per turnip on Michael Bay. Well, now that's tempting. Andy, in the chat, how do you feel about me heading over to your island and uh, selling some turnips at, at a high high prices? Andy is moderating the chat, so he might he might not have he might not be able to. Is this a good decoration? Well, we're making it. Uh, cool. All right, my gold nugget, that has to go in storage. Um, my yellow lilies, that was in my hair. You can go in storage. Um, these things need to be sold. Let's do some... Still a little organization here. If we can. What's this again? Oh, yeah, the tire stack. Okay. Do, 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 do. Career jacket, storage. Chino pants, storage, the knitted grass backpack, storage, my bros. Um, stones, we're going to get some more of these crafting materials out, the long locust. Uh, the bath towel wrap, that stays in my inventory, this is not up for discussion. Um, cool, alright, but I've actually got quite a lot of space there. Uh, the cherry blossom petal, I probably should just, I mean, I'll pick up loads more of those, but it should probably go in storage anyway. Um, right, and then materials wise, let's... Um, Let's grab some stuff. Uh, right. Wood. Here we go. As you can see, I'm doing all right for wood. Although that said, I've got loads more softwood and hardwood than I have actual just de genuine, you know, regular default wood. Um... Get my stones out. I've got quite a lot of iron nuggets, so there might be some stuff we can craft with that. I've got quite, you know, a fair amount of bamboo pieces as well. Uh, what I would really dearly love is some bamboo fencing. That would make me real happy. But we've got to work with what we got. Katie Johansson says, Luke, thanks for your streams, both the Animal Crossing and Breath of the Wild ones. So why I bought this game and started uh, replaying Breath of the Wild. Spending a lot of time on my island. Uh, Malarkey, Malarkey now though. Hyrule can wait from Sweden, Malarkey. That is very good. That is, ec that is top tier pun. Um, right. Do -ba -do, -do, -do. Do, do 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 Okay, well let's make some imperial fence. Is this just going to be like one piece? I bet it is. Well, what choice do we have? I wonder if KK Slider mines um, barbed wire fencing. Because I could put some around the kids' play area, you know? Alright, that was only like a, that was only a few pieces. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Where is it in the inventory? Oh, it was making batches of 10. Okay, that is much better. That is much better. That is a goodly amount of fence. Great, 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 great. All right, this is good news. Let's go, um, let's go make some fence. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go put up some fences, folks. Tom Titherington says, hi, can you still hear Ellen's imaginary giggles, giggles from earlier? Yes, I absolutely can. I forgot to make the shovel. Uh, back into the house we go. 
Everyone's like, shovel, shovel, remember the shovel. Matthew Minute says, just hopped on the stream, been watching all the previous streams on catch up. They keep me going while I'm stuck at home, unable to go motor racing. Um, right, okay, should I craft something? Yeah, I wanna craft. I wanna craft, what else can I craft? Just looking around. Log stakes, do they count as scenery? Uh, I think the wood can be put to better use. Um, oh, a log bench, that might be nice. And look, it's made of hardwood, which I have so much spare of. What else? Um, all right, I reckon that'll do me for now. Keep crafting, keep crafting. Nice. While we're here, do you folks want to see what else I've got in the uh, in the old wardrobe? Because I have some primo pieces in here. Let me tell you. The towel, of course. Check this out, though. Denim overalls. Aren't they nice? They're kind of like a sort of, like, it's like Mario bounding. Hey, this... That pairs nicely. With the boots? Where were the boots? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Or the shoes. Mm. No, I think with the socks. That's pretty good. Also, look, I've got a ballet outfit. Isn't that cute? Isn't that amazing? That's pretty good. <laughs> Andy in the chat says Goose Game Gardener vibes. Yeah, but would the goose would the gardener in the goose game pair it with this adorable little hat and these boots? I don't think so. Maybe with the flower. Nah, with the hat. With the, it's gotta be the hat. Yep, let's do it. I like to change outfits several times a day in this game. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> Look at it. Look at the liberals. Peter McCluskey says, Give me oranges, which is the last fruit I need, and you can sell turnips at my partner's island for over 400 bells each. Love from Glasgow. That is very generous. I'm I'm still hoping that... Um, still wondering if maybe... Uh, maybe Andy will let me onto his island to... Uh, to flog some turnips. He says that... Uh, Andy says the gate's open. Nice. All right. I tell you what. Why don't we go? Um, why don't we? Why don't we do the turnips? Why don't we do turnips first on Andy's island? Um, where did I put my turnips? I think I, st I think I stored them on the floor in here. Aha! Here they are. In the music room. Ben Sadler says, this really is the perfect game for these times. I've been able to hang with my nephew, even though we can't see uh, see each other during self-quarantine. Um, oh, that's awesome. That's awesome, Ben. That's really nice. Hanging with the nephew in Animal Crossing. Great. All right. Let's head over to Michael Bay. Cash in. I don't know how much money... Uh, Don't know how much money I'm going to make in total. Let's let's just see how much we have. Uh, I want to fly. Uh, I want to visit someone, Orville. Via online play, if that's cool, Orville. Uh, Timu Pulkinen says, newbie question, how to harvest bamboo? I failed. Uh, so I just tapped it with an axe, like with a regular tree, and that got me some... That got me some bamboo. Um... And then I, like, ate a fruit and dug them up to, like, pull up the whole thing so I could plant them on my island. How do you want to travel? Search for a friend, Orville. I'm looking forward to seeing uh, Michael Bay, Andy's Island. Um, I haven't been there in, in a little while. Looking forward to checking it out.
Typey, typey, typey. Oh, maintenance will soon begin. Uh, mm, that sounds ominous. That sounds like Nintendo's about to shut the servers down for a bit. Well, well, then I'd better hurry. Quick, fly quick, Orville. Sharpie says, did you give Andy the gothic style mirror? I, s I sure did. I sure did. Okay. Right, can we get there before this maintenance kicks in? This slightly ominous maintenance. Let's find out. Hey, I see Andy. Oh, he's got an outdoor vending machine. We'll be making a water landing, but that's okay because this is a seaplane. <gasps> Sarah James says, if you get there, will you be stuck? I don't know. I hope not. All right. All right, quick. Wow, look. Oh, man, this place is lush. Hey, look at Andy. Sitting at his ease. Let's give him one of my new reactions. Encouragement. Yeah! Ahoy! Alright. I'm just going to run around in circles. To say ahoy back. <laughs> um, <laughs> right. Uh, where is the shop? Here is the shop. Phil Tyler says, not a weed in sight in Michael Bay. <laughs> yeah, that is true. It's very neat. Oh, but a bunk bed on sale. And an explosive barrel. If Mike... Yeah, we got... Uh, and that should be on Mike's island, really. Um, I want to sell, Tommy. I want to sell my 100 turnips. <whistles> 57 grand. I wonder how much I put in. Maybe it was 30? Or maybe 40? I can't remember. But look, it's a good chunk of change. Did I get some milk mars for that? Ah, uh, yeah. Nice. Woo. Um, only made this to comment. Air says, get the barrel for Jane's junkyard. Oh, yeah, I forgot Jane was making a junkyard. Yeah, let's do it. Jane will appreciate it. 650 bells. Yeah, I reckon I can. I reckon I can part with that. Um, great stuff. Okay, so we've offloaded the turnips. Um, Dave Walker says, do you have more turnip? Do you have more turnips? Uh, no, that's all my turnips. Um, I bought as many as I could. Um, cool. All right. Nice. Well, thank you so much, Andy, for letting us take advantage of your... Um, for your increased prices. Uh, Andy, do you need anything? Let's ask. Need... Out. Thank you, by the way. Wait for Andy to reply. Goth stuff. Andy needs goth stuff. I don't know if I have any goth stuff on me. I mean, maybe I could give Andy the striped socks. But they pair so nicely with the dress. Um, alright. Andy... I'm afraid I have no goth. He's watching the stream, so he can he can see this. Andy, I'm afraid I have no goth stuff 
um, on me, but I'm gonna. I'm, I will keep an eye out. I will. I will get you back next time I find goth stuff. Okay, make yourself scarce. <laughs> All right, bye. All right, cool. Made a little money, um, which means now I think we should um, get Tom to place another bridge. Flying in over my orchard. She's looking nice. Rob C says, you missed Andy saying KK is coming over. Oh yeah, I did miss that. Make yourself scarce, KK is coming over. Oh, Andy. I love your turnip prices. But boy, do you love to wind me up. Um, right, okay, let's, let's, uh, let's get a new bridge on the go and make some fencing. Um, how about... How about fences first? Put some fencing up here. Yup. We've got some other stuff to put out here in this in this area. Um, got a little faucet. Um, where could we put that? Maybe that could go. Oh, you know where the faucet should go. Actually, that should go. Um, that should go near the sand pit. So, like, if you are. Um, if you've got all sandy from playing in the sand pit, then you can um, wash your feet off. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, lovely. Let's move it a bit closer, even. Nice. Oh, I'm very pleased with that. Oh, look! And uh, Beardo is making use of, of my little tyre thing. Oh, yeah, I've got to put the tyres down as well. Mm mm mm. Do, 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 do. Tire stack. Nice. Nice. Good. Good, good, good. Oh, I've just got a message from Andy. He says, I do need a drinking fountain if you have one or a recipe. I can't make an actual fountain till I have one. Oh, maybe we can help Andy out with a fountain, because I think I, I do have the recipe for a drinking fountain, and I might have the resources. Let's have a look. Let's see what's required. I'd like to help Andy out, because he was so helpful to me. Um, stone and iron nuggets. Yeah, I can I can whip up a drinking fountain. All right, we'll make Andy one of those, and we'll, we'll post it to him. Um, right, now, fence-wise, what do you think we should do? What's the right... What's the right concept for this island? Because I kind of don't... I kind of want it to be like winding paths, ultimately. And, you know, paved around here. And little paths kind of like offshooting to all these like little different zones. Um, oh my gosh, look at, the, look at that butterfly. Okay, I don't have you. You're gigantic. Nice and easy. What are you? A Madagascan sunset moth. And we got that little yes, which means it's quite rare. Wow, you're not from around here. Cool. Nice, good find. Sweet. Uh, Sean Eng says, uh, Hey Luke, what are your favourite KK Slider songs? Mine's KK Disco and Jazz. The answer is KK Samba is my favourite one. I absolutely love KK Samba. And Jack Broderick says, Hi Luke, first time commenter, thank you for keeping me sane during my air traffic control training. I passed in February. KK Reggae rules. Wow, air traffic control training, that's awesome. 
I tell you what, why don't we why don't we fence off a little area here and we can make like a little kind of chill sort of zen garden or something. That seems like not the worst idea. And look, we can always move it. Okay, building fences is a little fiddly, but here we go. Oops. Uh, nope. Hang on. No. Come on. I want you to join up with this one. There we go. That's more like it. Oh, lovely. This is looking good. Why don't we try and give this a slightly... Uh, like... Oh, this is nice. Why don't we try and give it like a slightly sort of, uh, no, irregular shape. Uh, William Sim says, hello from Tasmania. Uh, or none at all. It's great to catch a live stream finally. None at all. That's good. I think we should fill this with flowers. Uh, that'll be the little entrance. Oh, no, that didn't go exactly as I wanted it to. Uh, I tell you what, actually, how about we make the entrance like, yeah, on the diagonal. Yeah, that's that's nice. But should we enclose this tree? Yeah, let's do it if we can. It's gonna be a little fiddly building behind it. Let's just assume that this is working. Doom, doom, doom. Nice. Great. And come on. Oh, you can fit through there. Come on. Now that is very charming, I think. We fill this with flowers. I'm not sure this tree really fits. I feel like this should be bamboo. Why don't we move one of these bam- why don't we move this bamboo stalk? Uh, oh no, it is nice there. We could move one of these bamboo stalks, like swap them out. This is flower jail. This is where we put the bad flowers. I've got so many lilies on my island and I would like to mix it up slightly. Um, You know what, now that I've made that in there. I feel like feels like that would be a nice place to put my water fountain. So why don't we move that to just be in here? That'd be cute. Mm, no, it does take takes up quite a lot of space there. Come on, I meant I meant more like here. Do, do, do. No room, no room. No room. Maybe I should get rid of this tree. Yeah, I'm going to move this tree out of the way. Yup. Let's put it across the road, across the way. <gasps> put the Sakura trees in it. Now that is a lovely idea. Hey, I've got a lot of time for that plan. Come on. <laughs> I couldn't catch that pedal. Um, yeah, that's a cool idea. Let's do that. Let's just move one in. You seem like a likely candidate. Uh, Sean Chassau says, saw a deathmatch on Twitter where you hit each other with the net in an arena. Uh, you get hit, you're out. Would be hilarious to watch the OX teams do it. That's a good idea. Matt Willis says, hey Luke, nice, nice flower jail. Loving the chill stream. Could you play your ocarina on the island uh, for us NHS chefs working hard? 
Oh my gosh. Uh, wow, Matt. NHS chefs. Uh, I don't actually have an ocarina in the game. I think I do have an ocarina possibly in this room IRL though. Let me see if I can find it. I would like, I would like to give a musical tribute. Uh, David Burgess says, your Animal Crossing streams have really kept me relaxed. Thank you. Also made me spend an hour coming up with a pun name for my island. Jazz Sands. Oh, that's good. Jazz Sands is good. All right, here we go. Okay. Yeah, check it out. I do have an ocarina from this, what, Andy's from Showdown of the Week. So yeah, here we go. Sounds that sounds great, right? It sounds very good. Cool. Beautiful, right? Quite melodious. <laughs> Andy says time reverses. Right, now let's pop this tree down. Oh, come on. I know it's not really in the spirit of the game, but sometimes I just wish there was like a, a, a really brutal grid system so that you could see where you're putting stuff. Uh, right, the log bench. Let's pop that down. Oh, that's cute. Could be could it could it be further back? Ah. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. Mm -mm -mm. Just yeah. This is what a lot of There we go. Okay. Uh, no, after all that, I want it against this wall now. Yeah, that's nicer. That is lovely. But it is missing... Uh, flowers. Um, so... We need to go get some flowers. Which requires a Nook Mars ticket. That looks really nice! I hadn't really appreciated the, like, the gaps in it. Um... Which is nice. It just makes it feel like not not quite as like as oppressive as it as it possibly could have come across. That's nice. I really like that. That is nice fence. How much do I have left? Nine pieces. Nine pieces. All right. Well, I don't want to go. I don't want to go overboard on the fencing just for the sake of pleasing KK Slider. I want it to you know fundamentally look good. Oh, maybe I could pop some around around this. Maybe that would be a nicer nicer than the flowers. Then the flowers could go in the in the flower prison. Hmm. But how much space do I have? Do I have space for all these flowers? Not right now. What are these are these items I've got? Oh the drinking fountain and the oil barrel. Yeah, I guess I need to need to put the drinking fountain down. Let's put the drinking fountain back where it originally was, which was like here. This, I, I want to, there's going to be a bridge here eventually. I want to say eventually, I mean, hopefully quite soon, because... Yeah, let's talk to Tom about a bridge. Okay. Tom, my man, let's talk infrastructure. Hello, hello. Um, bridges and inclines, please, Tom. Boy, would I like a bridge, Tom. Now, I think it's quite fortunate here that, in my opinion, the nicest bridge is the stone bridge. But it is not, it is not the most expensive. Um, oh, no, I just realised that the red zen bridge, which costs loads more, would actually match quite nicely with the... It would actually match thematically quite nicely with the fencing we just put down. No, it's going to have to be a long-term upgrade or I'll never afford it. Lovely. Um, okay. Let's pop 
down where that bridge is gonna go. It's gonna go here. Oh, who's chatting to me? Oh, it's Daisy. Hey, Daisy. Just wanted to make sure to thank you, Luke. They say you've been trying to get KK to notice our island, so we'll come perform here. Bow wow! I'm grateful to you for trying to make this happen, Luke. Between you and me, I think I might be the biggest KK fan on the island. Hold up, Daisy. Hold up. Um, what in the actual heckins do you think you're saying? The biggest KK fan on this island is me. And unless you're looking to get poked in the river with my vaulting pole, I suggest you agree with me ASAP. Actually, I have something right here that might help. Okay, right, if you're gonna give me a present, maybe it's fine. I thought maybe you could use my air circulator here. Air circulator? Daisy, I think you might have given me a, a very bad gift. Let's have a look at it. Daisy, I... I don't know what to tell you, Daisy. Right, Cole, I need you to move because I'm about to put a bridge right where you're sat, mate. So, get a wiggle on. Is this going in the right spot? Yes, it definitely is. Uh, right. Bridge marker kit. Build here, please. Oh. Mm, hang on. I think that might... I think that might destroy my drinking fountain <laughs> if I do that. Uh, so, yeah, here we go. Build here. Yep, watch out, Cole. <laughs> Cole is crushed to death. Cool. Alright. How much do I have to put towards the bridge fund? Oh, not loads. Not loads. All right, Lloyd. Maybe we'll make we might make a bit more money on this on this stream. We'll try it. We'll see what we can do to pay it to pay it off. Uh, right, we've only got half an hour left on this stream, so let's go head to that mystery island, which means emptying out the inventory, so I have maximum space. Uh, which means finding Flick to sell my bugs for an increased price. Is Flick still up here? Flick! Flick! Flick, you're never around when I need you! Ah, there you are. Hey, Flick! Now, I gotta not accidentally sell that big new moth I found. This one, we're not selling that one. But these ones are all in the museum already. Yep, thanks, Flick. Jolly good. I love Flick's um, top, the little um, abstract ladybug. That's awesome. Do 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 do. Bum, bum, bum. Cool. Alright, and now we're down to the museum to drop in my big moth. Oh, oh. Sidetracked, sidetracked. Oh, good, it's fossil, it's alright. Oh, and there's another one. Another one right there. Could have easily missed that. No, 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 no. I think Flick's eating the bugs. I'm just going to say it. Okay. Good news, Blathers. It's time to shake Blathers awake. <laughs> Wake up, Blathers! This is very important. I have to donate a sunset moth to you. A Madagascan <clears throat> sunset moth. What a wretched thing. Alas, I'm obliged to ask, would you like to learn more about this specimen? 
Yes, please, partners. Yeah, I see. In that case, um, <clears throat> uh, the Madagascan sunset moth is said to be the most beautiful moth in the world, a sentiment even I can't deny. While most moths are nocturnal, this one flutters about during the day, making good use of the light. That is, when the daylight reflects off its wings, a kaleidoscope of colours are revealed. Oh, and uh, too bad it has such startling red feet. As a caterpillar, I might have found it almost tolerable otherwise. Almost, but not quite. Any hoot, my sincerest thanks for your donation. And though bugs are the bane of my existence, rest assured the wretched thing will get the best of care here. Cheers, blathers. <coughs> Anything else? Yeah, I've got a fossil to assess, buddy. Two, two of them. Two fossils. Come on, fingers crossed. Oh, something, something that's not in the collection. So one of these is one of these is brand new, brand new to Blathers. Let's find out. Let's find out what they are. They are <gasps> Archaeopteryx, good, and the Megasaur tail. Uh, cool, 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 cool. All right. Well, I can sell that Archaeopteryx because I've already got one and a spare. Okay, yeah, Blathers, come on. Where to begin? Who I had been hoping someone would bring me a Megacerops. This large fellow was a bit like our modern rhinoceros, but with two horns on its nose. Sadly, their small teeth restricted them to a diet of rather soft plants. Eventually, they died out. I feel there is a valuable lesson to be had there about learning to enjoy a variety of foods. And that is what I have to say about that. Any hoot, I would gladly accept your generous donation. Cheers, Blathers. I feel like you slightly phoned in the science on that one, but it's cool. Right. Do, 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 do. David Badalotti says, broke down and picked up a Switch and the game. I'm telling my PC it's Luke's fault that it gets no upgrade this year. Seriously, though, thanks for the awesome streams. Oh, thank you for watching. Um, right. Right. What's in my inventory? What do I need to get rid of? St oh, I didn't put down my drinking fountain. Oh, the air circulated. The oil barrel is going to Jane. That's fine. All right, this stuff's all going to storage except the fountain, which needs to go down, and the, and the fossil, which I need to sell. Okay, 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 okay. Ba 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 da ba. I want to sell Timmy. I want to sell you an old dinosaur. <laughs> If that's cool. And hey, have these clumps of weeds as well while we're at it. I'm going to sell the air circulator. I just don't like it. I don't think it's adding anything. And hopefully Daisy will never find out. Cool. Alright, back to the house. Don't forget the drinking, don't forget to make a drinking fountain for Andy. Do not worry. It is on my radar when we're at the house. Oh, I forgot to buy the Nook Miles ticket. Oh my goodness, round the houses. It's fine. Okay. Right. Now. Uh... Oh, I could have just sold those coconuts. Uh, you stone. Wait, okay, let's make Andy's fountain first. Boop. There we go. We'll post that on the way. Um, oh, I didn't put down mine. Uh, gosh. So, so forgetful. I tell you what, I'll just place it in the middle of my floor. Then I will remember next time I come in here that I need to put it down. Jane's oil barrel. Uh, we'll post that as well when we go through. Wood. Storage. 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 A storage. Iron nuggets. 
I'm not going to need the clay. I'll keep the nuggets with me for like emergency crafting. Also, got quite a lot of inventory now, so I'll probably be all right. Um, and the eggs. In they go. Cool. All right, that is actually quite a lot of space that we've got now, um, which is good. Which is good. Um, and then we've got the drink fountain in the oil barrel to send. Cool. Um, so, here's my question. What have I forgotten? I've got to go buy the Nook ticket. Then I go through the airport, post off those gifts. Should we check our island rating? Should we just see if... See if, any, see if that fencing has moved the needle even a little. What do you think, Isabel? Two stars still. I like how there aren't any ghosts around. Okay. Alright, so... Isabel wants more population and more island scenery. More fencing. More fencing. Um, Selena Bear says, what is with the pretzel, Luke? It's because it's a pretzel knot, and the island is called Not At All. <laughs> it's all consistent. Sam Smith says you can buy flowers from the shop. Yeah, that's a good point. Maybe I should just... Maybe I should save my... Maybe I should save my Nook Miles and... Let's just see what they've got in the shop. <laughs> Andy says, here's the feedback. It's bad. <laughs> Get your case lighter. <laughs> okay, um... Let's see. Let's see what they ha let's see what they have, flower wise. Um, cool. We've got hyacinth, lilies, windflower, hyacinth, windflower. Hmm. Uh, okay. Well, I don't want lilies because I got. So many lilies. What are windflowers like? Are windflowers like the sort of default flower? Like the flower that I already have some of? Red hyacinth. Sapling. Um. Maybe red hyacinth. Hmm. Tell you what. I'm going to look up what they look like. If I knew my flowers better. Oh, the hyacinth looks nice. Um. And the windflower, what are they? Okay, and right, it looks like windflowers are a bit more sort of a bit more standard. Hmm. Let's get some hyacinth. Let's get some hi red hyacinth on the go. I'll take five thousand. Um, I'll tell you what, let's also buy, s s um, so that's the red hyacinth. Can I have white hyacinth? No, we don't have that. But we've got white windflowers. I'll tell you what, what might look really nice is just red and white flowers in the flower jail. That sounds nice. That sounds, that sounds nice, right? Um, cool. Let's go plant them. Do 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 do. 
Yep. Okay. Now let's do some planting. Now, can you... What's quite useful is when you're planting trees, you can sort of specify exactly where you want them to go by, like, digging little, like, holes beforehand. Can you do that with flowers? Um, red hyacinth. Nice. Tell you what, let's go alternate. Let's alternate red and white. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Red. Whoop. And white. You know, I'm wondering if I should have made this enclosure a bit bigger now. Because then I would have used more fencing. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to just drop you. I meant to plant you. Carefully. Scrupulously. Do, 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 do. Very nice. This is going to be so nice. Have I got the right? Have I gone out of order? It's red, white, red, white, red, white, red. Yeah. Uh, and then, hmm. Do, 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 do. Uh, do, 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 do. And then white. How did I end up with... Uh, Dead Film Photo says, Luke, you're streaming earlier and earlier. It's not even midnight in Australia, and I just knocked off. What a delightful surprise. Hope the whole time is great. Thank you. Thank you for tuning in. How come I how come I've ended up with a red? What white? Red, white, red, white, red, white. How come I've ended up with uh one spare white windflower bag? Um But fine, I'm sure I can find a home for it. Um not in here though, because I don't want to break the pattern. Maybe just here. Maybe just like by you. Oops. No, 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 no. Mm -hmm. Let's pop it. No, I'll tell you what. Let's dig up this one. And then let's plant that here. Just try and, yeah, let's, we can make this a little, yeah, we can make our um, garden a little, no, 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 oh, come on. I'm thinking we can make our garden, no, oh my god, oh, frustrating, right, plant it, plant it, right, now dig a hole, there. Yes, that's that's what that's more like it. And plant that there, and then the last white one can go here. Whoop, there we go. Right, there we go. That is nice. Then we could put like something here, like another bench, maybe. That's going to look lovely. Uh, right, they need. Watering. Where's my watering can? Do I even? Do I? I don't even have one in my inventory. Well, we got to. We got to fix that. Yep. Oh, I think I hear a balloon. Yep, there it is. Out of the way, Daisy. Ah, no, no, no! Don't go in the river. Don't you do it? No, 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 no! Oh my gosh! No! Phew! Sky egg. Nice. Um. 
Right. What were we doing? Watering can. I'm just going to buy one. Uh, the Deadly Moogle says the other red flowers are potted plant icon in your inventory. Yes, figured it out in the end. Yeah, give me it. I know I've got one in storage, but just for time. And he's pretending he's hanging out with KK. Do, 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 do. No, don't. <laughs> don't. <laughs> okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. Right, let's water these bad boys. You are all going to look so nice. I love the way they sparkle when they've been um, watered. I have to go one at a time because I'm using the flimsy watering can lovely how long how many days do flowers take to bloom I'm not sure oh yes so I'm talking about these flowers are glistening positively glistening Did I miss any? Did I get them all? I think I got them all. Cool. Uh, Lord Puzo 9 says, I don't know why, but I suddenly want that anatomy model. Yeah, it's weirdly... It's weirdly pleasing, right? Um, cool. Right, I'm going to pop my drinking fountain down here. This is actually the one I made for Andy, but don't worry, I will... There we go. Yay. Oh, that's nice. How could KK not want to take a stroll around here? This place is a paradise. A lush paradise. Right. Um. Okay, we've only got 10 minutes or so left of the stream. Which means probably I'm not going to do that mystery island just because that'll take me a little while. Because um, you want to, you know, you want to strip mine it effectively. Oh, but then that said, I do want to like queue up a new resident. But then I've got one moving in tomorrow, so maybe that will like take care of that. Maybe that'd be okay. I don't want to like overload with residents unnecessarily. Uh, let's let's post Andy and Jane their gifts. I think that would be fun. Yep. And he's winding me up in the chat. Uh, right. Let's send some gifts. Let's send some gifts. And then hold ourselves a ceremony. And if we've got any time left. Hannah Alika says, what's the name of your island? It's called Not At All. Um, Alright, we got, we got our gifts. Yeah, we got Jane's oil barrel. We got the drinking fountain. Okay. Yo. Orville. I wait, no, I don't want you I don't want your services at all, Orville. I want I want the post office. Right. First let's send Jane her um her trash her her like explosive barrel. Um, this looks like appropriate letterhead, uh, for the scrap. Yard. Oops. 
<laughs> uh, no, Luke, that's not how you spell or type. There we go. Oil barrel attached. Send it on its way. Her Majesty says, I've watched so many of these streams that when I play Animal Crossing, my internal monologue is in Luke's voice. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I can only apologise. Letter sent. All right. Um, and now let's send Andy his fountain. Um, a friend, even though it's been so salty in the chat. Let's send Andy on Michael Bay. Uh, let's give him these plasters. Fountain. Oops, for you. I hope you and KK Slider enjoy it immensely, Andy. Right, and Andy is going to use that to craft a fountain. Cool. All right, gifts are sent. Uh, what should we do now? Should we hold the little ceremony? Should we make a bit more fencing? Let's hold the ceremony. Let's hold the ceremony and if there's any more time, um, maybe a spot of fishing. Because you never know, we might get lucky. Uh, do, 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 do. <laughs> Dave Walker says, do you th reckon there's an Animal Crossing themed restaurant that sells KK sliders? I would certainly hope so. Let's hold a ceremony, Tom. Gosh, which one? We hold a ceremony for a bridge? No, no, for the tailor shop, Tom. We don't need to hold a ceremony for, a, for every single bridge. Oh, look, the gang's all here. I was going to say, no, they're not. Where's Beardo? Um, but you can see, his, if you look over on the right uh, cherry blossom tree, you can just see like his little blue ear poking out. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to our dedication ceremony honouring Not At All's brand new tailors. I certainly gave them quite a lot of custom on day one. Thank you. Thanks to everyone's tireless efforts. Not At All is developing wonderfully. Yes, yes. This time we'll have some brief comments from Mabel and Sable. Ladies, if you would be so kind. Thanks to everyone, we've been able to open such a lovely shop here. I'll work hard with my sister Sable to make a nice place for you all to visit. So be sure to stop by. Sable, you want to say anything? Yes, please stop by. Oh, Sable. Mabel, Sable, thank you both so much. A few words from someone who made many valuable contributions. Yep, that's me. I think we all know what I'm going to add. Just leans into the mic, screams it as loud as possible. Blow up the PA system. Please get ready to join me in bringing this ceremony to a close. Alright, gotta get my commemorative photo. Yay! Oh, these ceremonies are so sweet. Do take care on your way home. How did we all get over to the tailors? There's, it's not accessible by bridge. Somehow they all managed it. Okay, right. Well, I have got a lot of work to do uh, in my spare time. Um, putting up some more fences, I think. A few more decorations. But we will, 
Oh. Just get off the bug. But we will make this island KK ready. Hey, Mira. Oh, a gift for me. An extra DIY recipe for a bunny day crown. Yeah. I want a bunny day crown. Let's take a look at it. Oh, well that looks odd. <laughs> cool, it's pretty cute. It's pretty cute. All right, still we got we got a few more minutes. Let's just do a spot of, spot of fishing to wind down. Wow, you really want to be caught, don't you, bug? All right, if it's that important to you. Okay, right, we're looking for clams. So I can have a little fish bait. Okay. Find spotting the clams really uh, tricky. Like, kind of soothing. But tricky as well. Like, the holes are so tiny and they appear like only inter intermittently. Uh, anything out on the pier? I'm fishing a lot by the pier recently because I'm trying to catch a, uh, trying to catch like a tuna or a marlin. That would be cool. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, a fossil. Hey, that looked like a butterfly I've not seen before. Whoa, so colourful. No, you look new. You look new. Hey, nice! An agrias butterfly. I wonder if it finds me disagriasable. <laughs> cool, I think that one was like medium rare. Just how I like my butterflies done. Come on, clams. Show yourselves with your tiny little, tiny little water spouts. Where are you? Oh. An empty can? I've never caught one of them before. It gives me an idea for a recipe. Is it something KK would like, do you think? Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. what was that? Oh, an umbrella stand. I don't want to make an umbrella stand. Oh, that is actually quite sweet. Clump of weeds and an empty can make a succulent. That's quite nice, actually. That's pretty adorable. And resourceful. Oh, not a lot of clams in the beach at the moment. What do we got here? Come on. Oh. It's a water egg. That's not a fish. I don't have very much. I don't know. I think I did I only get one clam to craft. Yep. Yeah. Oh, well, we're going to craft it anyway. near the town clock ringing out the hour which means it's nearly time for us to wrap up this stream oh oh that really nearly went in the sea but it didn't what was it what are you sky present oh bunny day merry balloons that's good that's good more bunny day more bunny day memories oh and amazingly now that we've ticked into 3 p.m We've ticked into what is undoubtedly my favourite bit of ambient. Oh, nice! I've 
got one of you already, but you're not so common, I don't think. Nice. Yeah, this is my favourite um, bit of town music. Uh, I'll head in and... Um... Oh, yeah. More eggs. It's like fish eggs. Caviar. Alright, let's see what we can get with that bait. Fingers crossed, everyone. We got... Oh, it's only a little fish. It's only a little fish. But we'll catch it if we can. Ah, oh, horse mackerel, nice. Nice, well, I think that is going to do it for our stream today. But we did good. We prettied up the island some. Um... Which is what we got to do if we want to get KK Slider here. Come on. Come on, you sky egg. Don't fall in the river. Did it fall in the river? I can't tell. Oh no, I think it, I think it was just behind the tree. That was lucky. Cool. All right, well, um, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to turn up the game audio a little so that you can hear my favourite bit of uh, town music so far. So nice. Well, thank you all very much for watching. This has been another real enjoyable stream to do. Um, what else have we got coming up this week? Uh, we got a video going up later on Outside Extra um, that, uh, that Ellen's made that I think is going to be fun, that I think you're going to like. And um, and then what's this that Outside Xbox has put in the chat? Why? It's a link to... Oh, my link didn't work. Ah, it's a link to a dice dice breaker painting stream that's happening now. So if you're looking for something else to watch, folks, have a look in the chat. Um, there is a there's a link to that. That's always going to be a good time, especially if you're like enjoying these chill uh, Animal Crossing vibes. Like those painting streams are real relaxing, uh, really really enjoyable. Um, so yeah, definitely check that out. Um, and then yeah, tomorrow we've got show of the almost weekend. Yay! Uh, in the afternoon, um, I think that is going to be at one o'clock, and then at three o'clock, if we can swing it, something pretty exciting, which will be on outside Xbox and will be live. Um, so yeah, check that out. Check that out. We'll be doing more Animal Crossing soon, um, but for now. That is it from me and not at all, but we will see you next time. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. Take care of yourselves and each other. Take it easy. Play it cool. And I would just implore you all to remember when I caught that stringfish. Bye.